Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough of oh, poopers. I have a hunch as to a lead on how to get the kinstone fusion that I am missing, or at least I think I'm missing. Uh, the reason why I'm over here by Tingle is because I'd like to show you something. If I have calculated correctly, he should say that there are four kinstone fusions left. Yeah, he. Uh, I didn't really mention this earlier in the walkthrough because I've been keeping track, but uh, Tingle here will tell you how many kinstone fusions you have left to do. That's twice we fused our kinstones perfectly so far. Say, I wonder if this will make me into a real and true fairy. It will, right? You wouldn't lie to me now. Tingle, tingle, kululimpa! I can't wait to be a fairy. Well, that wasn't the dialogue that I was thinking of. Let's try it again. Just a wee bit more, Mr. Fairy. That's right, you only have four to go. So, yep, I was calculating correctly. Just a wee tiny bit, then you'll have fused every last kinstone there is. That is good to know. So, I am indeed on track, like I thought. Now, this is what, what I think is going to trigger the kinstone fusion to appear. Remember, I pushed a boulder into a hole and there was two other boulders to push into holes in an underground area of Hyrule Town. Well, let's finish that little side quest now and see if that ends up leading to... Whoops. <laughs> if that ends up leading to the Kinstone Fusion. You'll see why when I finish it off. So let's pop that in there. You already know what I'm talking about now because you've seen that other boulder is in the hole. At least I hope you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Um, the other one is over here because I didn't have the means to do this at the time, so I had to skip by it. Remember this block? Remember, remember, remember December in the groove reference? There we go. <laughs> and push, 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 push. There we go. Let's move this out of the way. It's so much faster. Pushing then pulling. I'm switching sides. Okay. And there is the big prize. Even though we've gotten a prize similar to this before. Um, through this is where I think I will be able to activate the last Kinstone Fusion. You gotta bomb your way through uh, a bunch of stuff here. And 100 more rupees, delightful. Uh, but going through here, uh, you'll actually find a back door into a certain place that we've already been to. You'll see when I reach it, the end of it. Uh, this underground basement cellar-like thing uh, was supposedly built by the mayor for some reason as like shelter or something like that I heard. I'm not sure if it's true or not. But anyway, upon going through this door, you'll find that it leads to the school. Yeah, why the school? I don't know. That's that's kind of weird and suspicious. Then again, it's kind of uh, uh, boxed off as well. But anyway, I'm going to see if the Kinstone Fusion is active now with one of these guys. I think it's actually going to be with you. It is! It did activate the Kinstone Fusion. Yes! Tina, Fuse! Now, go hurry! Prizes, riches, and... What is this open? <laughs> uh, this I know this is at the... Um, oh, it's just a chest. Yeah, it's at the Trilby Highlands, which is just uh, west of town. Excellent, a perfect fit. Now, where is my good fortune? I'm going to get it. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm going to go trot over to that chest before I go fuse the last element with the sword. And so I'll see you. Oh, that's actually right here. I was going to say I'll see you there, but cutting seems kind of pointless. It's a red kinstone piece, so there we go. Alright, three Kinstone Fusions left. <sighs> In case you don't realize, the Kinstone Fusions are like this game's uh, Gold Skulltulas slash Pole Souls, you know, that kind of uh, collection quest of sorts. Some of them are necessary for getting the 100% uh, like when it comes to heart containers and stuff like that. Uh, but you do get a, a special prize for getting all the like, kinstone fusions, 
at the end of which I will definitely show you later on. Alright, I just gotta work my way through the castle one more time, well, castle gardens one more time. You have fun going that way, just, just, mm -hmm, just, just go keep going, keep going, I'll follow this one. And then I'll hide in this corner, it works every time. I mean, that path works every time. And there we go. Alright. Fusing the last element with the sword. Excitement. For this will reveal a little bit more about the sword we have as well. Here we are. This will look terrible on LCD screens. <laughs> I had to reference that one more time, just because I'm passing through it again. And... Bloop! There it is! The wind element. Power up! The sword is at maximum power now. The power of the wind element has infused your blade. With the power of the four elements, your blade has become the four sword. Yeah, now doesn't the splitting thing make a lot of sense in this game? Focus power in your blade and release to fire a beam. Use it to break Vati's curse and restore <clears throat> the people of Hyrule. Woo! What have you done, Link? What have you done? You have opened a new path. That was brilliant. Mm -hmm. It seems that forging the sacred blade somehow opened the doorway. It must lead to the room that holds the secret of the light force. Link, we must go inside. All right, let's do so. Yeah, I'll give you a little tour of this room. Actually, there's not really much to give you a tour on. That's pretty much it. Hmm, how interesting. Look at the images on the stained glass. I bet the, those pictures show us where the light force is hidden. Deja vu? Indeedly do. So anyway, uh, a little bit of thoughts about the sword. Um, it's... It might very well be the Four Sword from another Zelda game. And the White Sword may also be a different White Sword than another Zelda game. Because, you know, the White Sword and the Four Sword have appeared in other Zelda games. But since this is uh, one of the earliest games in the Zelda timeline, you know, it's, it's kind of one... I mean, you kind of have to wonder how the swords got the way they did, if they're the same swords. Because, as you know... These swords were forged before, you know, so it's possible that they could create more of them. <laughs> so that's what it means. What up, oh, boobers? <laughs> Hello. You really are too kind. First, you give me my magic cap, and then you guide me here. You've been far too generous, but now... I no longer have any use for you. It's Vati. No, oh poopers! Zelda should have given me that heart container. She really should have. <laughs> At last, I finally know the location of the life force. Duh. Oh, pain. Link, wake up! Can't you wake up, Link? I'm up, I'm up. Vati disguised himself as the king to search for the life force. When he learned of this place, he waited for us to reforge the blade. If that stained glass is accurate, Princess Zelda holds the life force. Vati will do whatever it takes to steal that power from her. If he succeeds, we may never be able to return the princess to normal. We've wasted too much time, Link. We must stop Vati! Indeed we must. But first, let's gaze. Oh, that's not, that's not gazing. <laughs> that's just that once we leave here, we can come back here again, you know, later on. It's just the way that the, the game locks you out of the... Whoops. 
Love the super fast charging ability of that sword. Alright. And once we leave... Welcome to the final dungeon. Yeah, there's been a little bit of renovating going on here. What? What is this? What happened here? They've been turned to stone? All of them? The minister? And the guards? Everyone in the castle, all just like Princess Zelda. This can only be the work of that evil Vati. What cruelty, Link! You must use the power of the sacred four sword to undo this evil. So, and this is what he's hinting at, just got charge up. Unleash the sword's power. And, oh, oh there we go. Link, <clears throat> I forgot what his voice is like, actually. <laughs> I did it so long ago. I think it was something like, uh, oh, Link, I need your help. Vati took our petrified princess to the roof of the castle. He must be planning something fiendish. You must stop him. Indeed I will, but first I must free this guard just because. Yay! Oh, oh, thank you. You're the one who returned me normal, aren't you? I don't know how you did it, but I can't thank you enough. Listen, have you seen how strange the king has been lately? That's because it's not the king at all. It's Vati. He's taken over the castle. Darrrr! One by one, he turned us, turned us all to stone. Everyone, cursed by his evil magic. Then the monsters arrived. Even paralyzed, I saw it all. I only pray it's not too late to undo his evil. And one more. And that is the power of the four sword, besides being able to split yourself in four. And, oh, you didn't. I thought you were going to talk to me automatically like the rest. The real king of Hyrule must be locked up somewhere in the castle. Please find him. As soon as we're recovered, we'll start looking too. Alright, here we are. Dark Hyrule Castle. Yep, big time renovating here. Whoa! Is this really Hyrule Castle? I can't believe it! What's happened here? Vati's magic has grown more powerful than I'd imagined. But the king and Zelda are in danger, Link. Let's go! You know what? The first thing that we're gonna do in this dungeon is get out of it. <laughs> no kidding. We uh, there's actually three more Kinstone fusion that that's unlocked just because we entered this dungeon. And I'm gonna grab this fairy. I should say just because we fused the sword, uh, you know, the four sword with the final element and stuff like that. So that triggered the last three Kinstones to uh, uh, Kinstone fusions to appear in the world. Now you'll notice that we're actually trapped in here. We've actually got to find our way out of the dungeon. That's Kind of interesting about this in that it's pretty unique well i mean it's not i mean other games have done this too but they didn't do it in such a surprise like this kinstone piece is this a yeah it's a door mimic that's what i thought aha oh, oh oh no that's a real door huh i must keep that in mind as i traverse the fire bars from mario i could plop down there but i don't think i want to drop down there just yet if I recall correct, oh geez, no, bad. <laughs> Those fast ones are really bad. I guess I could have just dropped down there. Uh, wait, isn't there a bombable wall somewhere? I, oh wait, actually, I think I did miss a bombable wall. Hold on. I and I, and I need to. Yeah, I was wasn't being very un, being very observant there. There we go. Aha! Dodge of the wisps. And now, whoop, gotta transform. And follow this path. The reason why I have to follow this path is because, oh geez, is because, uh, no, oh, that doesn't hurt me a minish. I didn't know that. Is <laughs> because there is, fall along here. Well, you still gotta traverse this area. But there's a little hole right here, we seen as we came down, which leads to the prisons. Well, I, I yeah, they're prisons, but I mean that they are, um... It's kind of odd that you can go into them and leave freely as a minish. Well, then again, I mean... But I... I mean, just think, there's a hole right there with an arrow next to it. And... I don't know. <laughs> it's just not much of a prison for the minish, I guess you could say. So here is the real king. Yay! And why, why is he even in a cell anyway. I mean, he was frozen. <laughs> oh, Link, 
Are you the one who broke the curse and returned me to normal? You've grown quite brave since I last saw you, I must say. But oh, how this castle has suffered while I was under Vati's curse. Is this all the work of one man? As King of Hyrule, I must do something about this villain. But ah, uh, I'm old, and I would only hold you back. Link, you have the Sacred Blade now. We must rely on you. Please, you must find a way to rescue my Zelda. Take this key. You can use it to get out of the castle from the basement. Woo! I got a small key! Yeah! Alright. I still find it weird that there's that little mouse hole there. I just... I don't know. Maybe they want to torture the prisoners a little bit with, like, mice going into their cell or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> I just always found that hole weird. Like, you know, that they wouldn't box it in for whatever reason. Okay, let's do this. Oh, that's right. I gotta have the solid link up front. There we go. It's so just a little shortcut back. And now I can open this. Which is... Well, it almost leads me to the... Uh, well, no, this isn't the entrance just yet, but I will grab the thing that's up those stairs. It's... Quite nice, it's the dungeon map! Oh yes, and it's a pretty big dungeon too, I'll just give you a little tour of the place. It should be, I mean, it is the final dungeon of the game, by the way. And uh, speaking of by the ways, there, uh, in case you didn't realize, I think that that whole prison area was like a reference to Link to the Past, like early on in the game when you would have to go into the prison cell and, I mean, uh, you know, open the prison cell. But anyway, look at this, look at this! We've made it out! We've made it out! So, I'm gonna leave the dungeon behind for now. Look at this. Everything is just fine right now. No, no, everyone is just oblivious to what's going on. <laughs> well, kind of. Um, if you go back to the town at this moment in time, I... Why am I not warping there? I don't know. <laughs> uh, but if you go back to the town, you'll probably notice that there are less people around town, and maybe those monsters are why the king has been acting so strange lately. So yeah, quite a few people abandoned town, which is a point in the game where Kinstone Fusions will jump to other people. But most importantly, is well I guess this isn't, isn't that importantly, the library at this point in the game is now locked off to you forever. So if you miss that treasure chest inside that uh, uh, path there, well, you lost it. <laughs> But it's not a essential chest or anything like that, as I mentioned before, and I already showed you what the prize of it was. You know, the one that you had to melt uh, the ice around the, to get it. But anyway, I am blabbering because it's like 18 minutes now, so I should probably end off the part here because I've got a couple more side quests to do in the next part. So I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you then.